here in the i button and in description box below you will get complete playlist of laplace transform now i welcome you to video number 39 and in which and in this video we are going to study about unit step function okay this unit step function is also known as heavy sides unit function okay in certain books you will see uh, this topic as unit step function and in certain books it is uh, it is named as heavy sides unit function okay before starting this video i would request you to like and subscribe uh, sorry subscribe to this channel and like this video if you uh, seriously learn something from this video and do share share with your friends okay yes now starting this topic that is unit step function or heavy sides unit function okay yes unit step function is defined as u of t which is equals to 0 when t is less than 0 okay and u of t okay is equals to 1 when t is greater than or equals to 0 okay here i have plot on graph yes in the x axis you have t and in the y axis you have u of t what is u of t u of t is unit step function okay u of t is what unit step function okay yes here t is 0 okay so if you see this side the value of t is how much less than 0 so the function f uh, u of t is how much is 0 but from t equals to 0 to okay if you see here t is less than so t is greater than equal to 0 in this case the function f uh, u of t is how much 1 so here you can see from 0 this is 0 okay from 0 to uh, right hand side you can see the u of t is how much 1 okay it is 1 throughout it is 1 okay yes now coming to delayed part or the displaced that is u of t minus a yes the delayed or displaced unit step function which is represented as u of t minus a okay it represents the function u of t which is displaced or delayed by a distance of a to the right okay yes i am repeating this once again the delayed or displaced unit step function u of t minus a represents the function u of t which is displaced or which is displaced or delayed by a distance of a to the right okay here you can see yes in the x-axis you have t in the y-axis you have u of t minus a yes yes u of t minus a is 0 when t is less than a okay yes less than a u of t minus a is how much 0 okay u of t minus a becomes 1 when t is equals to or greater than a okay yes from here you can see the value of u of t minus a becomes what becomes 1 okay yes um, okay yes so i'm going to stop this video here and in this uh, in next video that is video number 40 we are going to study about laplace transform of unit step functions okay thank you so much for watching this video thank you